Hi everyone, it's Busy Living here. Here are my top 5 tips on choosing a gift for a guy. Choosing a gift for a guy can be a difficult task, no matter how much you love them, how well you think you know them, or how long you've known them. This is common to every female, I'm sure. But when you think of it, it's such a great opportunity to make your boyfriend or your fiancé or your husband happy and show them how much you care and love them. So without waiting, here are my top tips and I really hope it will help you in this exciting process of gifting. By the way, these are tips that will help you decide what to choose or buy for him rather than me giving a general list of products that guys usually like. So here's tip number one. Look out for hints from him in the months and weeks leading to the big day, whether it's his birthday or Christmas, anniversary or whatever. If you really pay attention, they will say things like, I've been looking for a crisp white shirt but didn't have the time to go shopping, or I need to get a new camera, my old one is really not doing the job, or things like, remember the aftershave I had from whatever brand that they liked, need to get one when I see it again, etc, etc. Or they will be talking about some gadget, for example, the latest version of a smartphone or something similar, praising it and showing signs that they would love to own one. So go with it. It's your chance to choose a gift by going with those hints and to show him actually you were listening. Trust me, they will love you for it. Tip number two. Tickets to an event that he likes. If you have been with this guy for a while, then chances are that you know what type of events that they like. If you two have just met, or okay, you won't gift anything to someone who you have just met, but if you two have just started going out, or just started knowing each other, then you can find out. Maybe they like motorbikes and cars related shows, musical shows, art exhibitions, latest techie related events, perhaps an outdoor related adventurous event, or simply to go watch a match of their favorite sport like rugger, tennis, football, cricket, I don't know. Gifting tickets to such an event can never go wrong, trust me. They will love it and appreciate that you have understood their interest in whatever it is that they like. Tip number three, a gift that relates to action. This means a gift that gets them to operate something, you know, like a remote controlled mm, toy or something like that. Not exactly a toy, but something that gets them to operate it and get them some thrilling excitement out of it. Um, but of course, something that is harmless, like a remote control operated gadget, like I said before, uh, you know, similar to a drone or a hoverboard, a GPS thing a computer or a gaming accessory that can be useful to them, etc. This is the category where Xbox will fall into. This as well will be highly appreciated by the guy in your life. They all love action and excitement. If you have loads of money to spare, buy him a motorbike and see how his eyes will light up. Okay, tip number four. My fourth tip is to save you from him being disappointed. Please do not buy anything offensive. With a gift, all we want to do is make them happy and not hurt their feelings. So think before buying something that they don't like, but fits your perception of a perfect gift. Example, if they like messy hair and don't like combing or brushing it, don't give them hair brushes and combs and stuff as a gift, even if you think they'd look better with neater hair. This may be a bad example, but I'm sure you get the point. Remember? Our objective is to make them happy on their big day and not teach them lessons. Tip number five, personalize whatever you're gifting. This simply means if it's a pen or a leather belt or a wallet, then engrave it with a meaningful text or with simply their initials. If it's not something that can be engraved, then get some extraordinarily beautiful or funny or different wrapping done. They will of course tear through all the wrapping etc once they receive the gift in a second being guys but no doubt they will appreciate and remember all the hard work you've put into making it personal. If you're tight for time then attach a lovely card on which you write something meaningful and loving. This cannot go wrong and you will be happy you did all the extra work. So these are my top five tips on choosing a gift for a guy respective of their age and I'm nearly 100% sure that it will not go wrong. 
I really hope that these tips will help you choose the perfect gift for your guy and please give a thumbs up if you like my video. Also please share your own tips on selecting uh, gifts for guys in the comments below and I'm sure it will help us all. And please don't forget to subscribe for more such videos. So happy gifting ladies and I'll see you soon with another video. Bye!